Well, hello everyone. I decided to keep this much simpler. This is something that I've only started investigating lately and I know we'll have a lot of success with it. So using the motion plate, with thanks to Flightscope, our partner from across the road for making it possible, using the motion plate to measure pitching and chipping. So, as you can see, this is some great software. As the video runs, you will see some things moving at the top right. And those things are, that is my left foot, right foot, pressure under the right foot, pressure under the left foot at any time, and distance that my feet are apart, which uh, makes a bigger difference than you may think. So I am exaggerating this a little bit because this is a, such a great example of what, I, what I'm seeing so far. So we can now magnify, or enlarge for more detail, this is great software. And now this is now looking from above me, from imagine above my head down and so it was an amazing experience for myself to after 29 years, remember this is invisible, we never see it. So we focus on lots of other things um, uh, other than where our pressure is. So I'm just showing this, uh, I nearly said koliki, that dot is basically the average of our pressure. Let's call it that for simplicity's sake, or the middle because you saw I'm 63% on the left. So when you start moving that, that you could move in any direction, that dot could move this way, that way, that way, this way, or that way. Now, because where the most red is, is where most pressure is. So as I, as I said, I saw this for the first time after 29 years and no wonder I can hit a fat shot if I if I want to. So there's very little pressure on my heels, you can see there, that's very blue. So it's already a lot to the toes and guess what happens? This is how forces function in the swing. As soon as the swing begins, uh, this dot you will see will most likely move to even more towards the toes. So let's see what happens. Yeah, so as this as the motion starts, because it was already towards the toe to begin with, there you can clearly see that that uh, pressure is moving forwards even more towards the toes. So, and what does this or what does this mean? So, it simply means if I just draw a circle here. Oops. I'm going to practice my circle making as well. You will see that, that this tiny movement forwards is that tiny movement in the head moving towards the ball side. And what does that mean? So if I, even though I've addressed the ball opposite the center of the club face, when I come down and I, if I haven't compensated backwards enough, which is, which is very damaging. And this is all about relieving the, the compensations. You can clearly see now that the ball is in a very dangerous position. It's closer to the hosel than it was at address, which means this was actually quite close to a shank. So if we now take an example of now, once I've realized this, just going to take, just going to remove this very quickly. So now in this example, this is now after I've tried to get the weight more to the pressure more to the middle, it is still not where it should be. It just shows how used to it I've become. It should still be more to the middle, but the spread of, of pressure is better on that one. And so now when I swing, there's, there's 
definitely much less shift towards the Taz. But that's only because I'm aware of it now. And if we if we look at this in the video, we will now see if I draw a better circle here, it's then the head stays still and therefore I can get a better strike. Won't hit it fat or as fat or uh, a shank as often as before. And that is how improvement takes place. So very simple improvement uh, with this great technology. Uh, it's, as I said, it's the last thing that one thinks of because we don't see it. But now we can, thanks to Swing Catalyst and Flightscope. So what's also great is I can make this live. In other words, you can stand on the plate and in front of you on the screen, you can actually see where you are at the moment. And then what it feels like to be in the middle, to the toes, to the heels. And then you will also realize why you have been hitting some strange shots too often. And why we need all the help we can get uh, as, as with this. So even if you think your pitching and chipping is, or your short game is fine, have a look at the office below the shared option, which is perfect for this. And thank you very much. See you at the club.